let us start the chapter list in html as you must have seen different types of list like a list of numbers list of alphabets list of uh, roman numbers or list of uh, bullets also similarly we can also create uh, four different types of list in html one is ordered list unordered list nested list and description list these are the four different types of list ordered unordered nested and description in ordered list ol tag stands for ordered list in ordered list we can have a list of sequence of a particular sequence if i want to make a list of uh, roll number all the students uh, name roll number wise of your class that's an ordered list but if i want to write the name of five fruits then there is no particular order i can write any fruit at the top and any uh, fruit at the end so that is an unordered list and nested list is a combination of both ordered and unordered nested means a list within a list is called nested list in which we can use both ordered list as well as unordered list description list means it's like a dictionary in which we can have a term and then the definition of that term that this type of list is known as description list now first let us understand the order list order list means in which we have a particular sequence now we can create three different types of order list we can create a list of numbers we can create a list of alphabets now alphabet can be capital also and it can be small also we can also create a list of roman numbers it can be capital as well as small so this is these are the three different types of order list next is unordered list in unordered list we again have three different types we can have a list of disk disk means here we are using the bullets the disk means the circle which is filled from inside next is circle circle which is hollow from inside and a square square is just a square so these are the three different types of unordered list now let us start creating an ordered list first for that we have to open the notepad now write the basic html code that is that is html head title now i am writing ordered list close title close head body close body close html this is the basic structure of html this is a basic structure of html now let me add the attribute of body tag that is bg color equals to yellow now i am going to start a font tag size equals to 6 color equals to red i am going to use a h1 tag for the heading i am creating a list of five fruits name in the center of and i want to put my heading in the center of the screen so h1 tag center tag then i have to write fruits fruits name close the center tag Close H one tag. Now we have to create an ordered list, so we will start the OL tag. Well, now why I have pressed the tab and shift my cursors because so that I will would be able to know from where I am starting the OL tag and after how many lines I have to close it. so it will just clear my formatting style on the notepad now to insert the items in the list you have to use li tag li means list item now i am going to write the first item 
close li after every item you have to close li also close li then again open li close li close li and my list is complete here so i'm going to close the order list that is old tag and then we have to close the font tag which we have opened in the beginning so the list is complete now let us save it first i'm going to save it with li sorry ol.html now let us check how the page will appear right click and open with google chrome so this is my ordered list okay by default numbers are coming 1 2 3 4 5 5 but suppose i want to make a list of alphabets then what changes i have to do here i have to add an attribute of ol tag that is type attribute type equals to a if you want to create a list of alphabets then you have to write a either capital a or small a and if you have to create a list of roman numbers then you have to write i so first i'm creating a list of alphabets type equals to i and then i want to start alphabet i don't want to suppose start from a i want to start it from k in that case you have to write the position at which that alphabets come like k comes on 11th k comes at 11th position so right now i'm just beginning it from 1 uh, start equals to 1 save it and check it refresh the page by pressing f5 now it's a list of alphabets now let us convert it let us start the alphabets from uh, uh k so we will write 11 check it now f5 now it is starting from k next is now i want a list of roman numbers which should start from 11 suppose save and check f5 now it is starting from 11 you can also write a capital roman number i have written a small i you can also write a capital i so in this way we have created three different types of ordered list numbered list in which you can you can also write it like this like suppose numbers i want to start from 101 save and check Mm, it is not completely coming on the screen. Uh, let me take it as fifty. Now it is fifty, fifty-one, fifty-two, fifty-three, and fifty-four. So this is how we can create an ordered list of three different types: numbers, alphabets, and Roman numbers. Now let us convert the same ordered list into an ordered list. Change the title to an ordered list. Tag to ul. Ul will become ul here. Rest of the things will remain same. There will be no start attribute in ul tag because all the bullets will appear same. If either it is a circle or it is a square or uh, means if I'll shift the mango at first position or apple at uh, the fourth position, then the bullets in front of that will remain same. So it doesn't matter. So uh, let us first check what is the default type of ul. So I'm just writing ul and I'm not writing 
the type attribute and check now f5 so by default it is coming the disk a circle which is filled from inside now let us change the other two types ul type equals to circle save and check now it is circle now let us change it to square save and check now it is square so this is how we can create an ordered list and unordered list